Aha! Your retreat has been sealed, despicable zombie. I will enjoy watching your gruesome demise. Clifford, you've arrived! Arf, arf! Okay. So, I'm just rolling this guy purely- oh, that hurts. Purely with avoidance tactics. Uh-oh. It seems like it got pissed. Ow! Holy shit, that hurts. Okay, so we need to... Avoid... For, like, a while. Ah, it got me. Okay. That's a tough sucker. Uh, well, in that case... We're just gonna go with this. Now, do we just immediately go into the fight? Nope. Same dialogue. Wow, that is that is really badass looking. Yeah, so my An ow. My main strategy for all of this is just to go full ham on poison. And pure avoidance. I feel like we glitched him out. But I can't really comment on that too much. Ow. Those hurt. Okay, he's almost dead. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. So, as long as I just mash that roll button, we can just roll through the lot of this. Freaking thank you iframes. Is he gonna chill? Okay, he's not gonna chill. Did we get him? I have no idea. Oh, it's dead. Arf! He's the strongest zombie you've ever fought! Arf! 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 Stop repeating and translating- uh, Stop repeating and translating everything I say! I- I know, but- but- You need to get rid of that abominable thing, can't you just try again? Arf! Wait! Don't go! Oh? Ah, uh, you think you've won? This is just the beginning and I'm still preparing for your demise! I'm not running away, I'm giving you a fighting chance, or whatever's left of it! <laughs> Well, not quite a dog. Not even close. Yeah, that was that went full bullet hell. Luckily, the iframes are so freaking hard, you really just don't need to hello. I can live in parts to appear zombie. This is your typical skeleton. Isn't your typical skeleton war, is it? Yo, it's been a while, Gr Hey, I heard you got a new name. What is it they call you? Gordon Inspector or something? The mighty Gordon Inspector of the Forest. Because of your lack of restraints, your servant paid dearly 
for di disrupting the natural order. Ooh, watch out. Big scary green flames, forbidden magic, only mastered by the friendliest and unemployed. What are you trying to do? I'm here to spread culture and civilization. I'm putting together our books and training the next generation of magical chefs. If I remember correctly, you wrote this volume. If your skills haven't gotten rusty from all the plant babysitting you do these days. How can a spirit who can't eat or taste food possibly cook food that others will enjoy? Meaningless, and I learned this a long time ago. Besides, there's no longer anyone around to... La la la, blah blah blah. Love to chat, can't hear you, don't have time. I'm taking the book. Do what you want, take it. But you can say goodbye to your zombie chef if you continue to trample on my world. What this place needs is natural balance and order. I will incinerate anything that tries to disrupt my work. Don't worry about any of that. Just nab all the ingredients you can lay you can lay your hands on. I can revive you, so I've got your back. Lohas Phase 2 Recipes revealed culinary secrets from Lohas Phase 2. Phew, she's finally gone. It's always nagging. I set up another camp at the other half of these ruins. The whole place is now a small rainforest filled with giant spiders and mantises. That's right, in order to become a top chef, you must continue to eat insects. I'll meet you there. I just need to space out for a little bit. Told you already, I'm spacing out. Why would you expect me to say anything else? Go out there and make some new dishes. You're giving me that look. That I want to hear more gossip look. <laughs> well, since you're able to take on Clifford, I'll share just one tiny morsel with you. I've known that weirdo with the green flames, the Lord Protector of the Forest, for a very long time. Magical cooking used to be illegal, so we'd have to set up secret kitchens, like this one, to re research new dishes. We developed all sorts of new techniques and dishes there. Or here. That's why there's a volume written by her. But stuff happened, everyone died, and she turned into that green tyrant that she is today. If you want to learn more, give me, give me the next volume. Phew. Okay, it's the same thing. Music got dire and kind of loud. And yes, the Lord Protector is probably female, but I can't do lady voices. So instead you could just get you just get uh throat pain voice from me. Okay, we don't have anything. Well, it seems like the damage over time effects that I rolled with worked pretty damn well. I Oh, I can climb walls. Should let you climb walls. Be honest, this is the first time I've seen the boss treat a worker so well. We have the same. I don't think we have the same employee benefits. Oh. Okay, this seems like a secret. Ow. Well, I died. That got messy. Uh, let's go back up here. We... Whoops. Okay. So Slime Swarm is a concern, but only a small one. Okay, last recipe, Seafood Hot Pot. Very straightforward, throw all the water creatures into a pot of water. Okay, so the trick here is, use poison. Everything gets easier when you use lots and lots of poison. Okay, uh, let's see. I actually know if there's anything useful on the other side of this, no. Yeah, the secrets in this game are relatively, whoops. So if we can get some sweet spider themed poison abilities. Probably not from that though. Ow. Okay. 
Okay, kill that. Get wood. King spiders, man. They're a lot of them. They were monkeys at first. Yeah, how much sentience does our protagonist even have here? I'm actually quite curious. Is it, what the hell is that thing? I understand spiders and insects. Oh, this thing is apparently a plant. Len Eye. It's still staring at me. And they shoot through the walls. Easier to fight than spiders, though. Or freaking slime swarms. Slime swarms go full, full bullet hell. These guys just stay away from the face bits and you're good to go. And those guys are just chumps. Ow. Wait for this thing to finish dying. And, well, there's that. Oh, so, what do we have in here? A wooden gun. Allegedly dangerous ancient we weapon. But not that one. And I died. But that's fine. Because now we got some stuff that I can actually uh, cook with and make stuff with. So what do we got? We have a laser staff. Yeah. Are they both secondary weapons? The only problem is they don't have... Yeah, I think my damage over time might be slightly better. Damage output of a fully drawn bow attack increased by 50%. Movement speed increased while bow is drawn. Or attacks inflict spider poison. Yep. More damage over time effects. You ain't felt damage until all the damage is being done to you constantly. Ah, I can kill those things. Look at slimes. I'm a wizard. I am just that and poison. Kill those things. That's a nice spider there. Question is... It's me or the spider. Good question. Always me. I am literally a professional internet person. The internet is toxic as hell, therefore I am toxic as hell. That's how this works, right? I think it is. I don't know. In laser jerks. Hopefully we get, like, a poison dagger at some point. I actually kind of wish there were less weapons in the game, but you kept modifying them with different, uh, different creature parts. So you could just, like, go all in on super poison dagger here. Because that would be really satisfying. Ow. It does take some getting used to specifically not having to sit there and attack an enemy. I just have to hit them like once or twice and then we just like bail. Great. Oh. Okay. So thank you, Verisoc, for the 500 bits. Expecting you were busy with the holiday stuff. I guess I was wrong. Thank you. Hope you guys are having lovely holidays. Because I am having... It's a very non-Christmas holiday, but it is a very nice, pleasant holiday. I, I gotta figure out where things... What's this? No idea. We've already done that. What? Anything new? Hey, you know how I was talking about a new poison dagger? Yeah, spider dagger. Uh, spider dagger. What else have? Water shield. Mantis sword. Eh. I'm really... I'm digging where I'm at. I hope I can get another... Oh. 
These suckers are jumpy. Bit of an uptick in difficulty, but that's fine. Because I mostly just have to focus on dodging here. Can help you if anything in this game is immune to poison. I would be in trouble, yes. I'd, I would be in a lot of trouble. Man, those iframes are extremely forgiving. I'm really enjoying this. Night shift, so this is closer when you go to work. Oh, I see. I've always been mildly curious about that. Fried fish. What the? Sentient water clap. Oh, ow, ow. Land boss. I have been prepared for that. Water spirit cores. Pretty sure these are just clams. It's a little bit more than just clams, but yes. Welcome to what used to be Lohas Phase 2, where I lived happily and wasted away my days as a student. But I'm determined to make your life fulfilling and important to all of us. See this billboard? It actually shows a way we can get out of this dungeon using a Stargate. Through, wor through working many engineers and mages of the bone, the government was able to put together this Stargate project. As long as you can reach the Stargate, we can get out of this place and make cooking great again. That board inspector has blocked me from accessing it at every turn. I tried sending skeletons to distract her, but they've all been thwarted, either because they were too stupid, too fat, or both, like Tyler. Hey, I heard that. But you're re you've reignited my hopes for this plan. The closest Stargate original prototype made by the government. It's located at a science facility near the surface. I need you to help me distract that Lord Protector so others can move my things to the Stargate. I don't need you to defeat her. You just need to stall for time. This is a big responsibility, and I know you won't dis disappoint me. After all, I was the one who taught you everything you know. Okay, what else we got? Spray a blast of water when attacking enemies with a spear. That's actually pretty good. Dagger attacks inflict serious bleeding. Yeah, it's, that's damn good. Let's get rid of this. Water shield blocks 20 points of damage. Axe and hatchet attacks create a watery wave, inflicting extra damage. On the air, rolling slash. Nope. Dagger attacks. Okay, what, o what else do we have? Honestly, I'm going to get rid of the grilled shrimp in favor of seafood hot pot. The water shield that blocks 20 damage comes back every 10 seconds. That should actually work better. That's a lot of dips. What else we got? Uh, let's see. Hatchets, hatchets, bows. By summons two friendly mantis spirits. That almost sounds good, but I'm keeping with my dips also make the uh, mantis sword be happy with what I got. Who are you? Hi, I'm Emma. I'm actually responsible for placing and maintaining all these recycling bins. I used to learn necromancy with Simmer, and her skills were always miles ahead of everyone else. Like with reanimation spells, we usually need to be close to the corpse to make it happen. I don't understand how Simmer can just automate the whole process with magical items. don't mind the mess, we're getting ready to leave this place for good. At the end of the day, this isn't really a good place to develop a culinary legacy. No one's around to eat your food. Where's the fun in cooking, right? What are we loading onto these trucks, boss? Emma, it's just a load of junk. Our boss is a major hoarder. Look, why do we even need a sofa? It's too heavy and takes up too much space. That sofa's been with us for a long time, way back when you were still alive. Remember when you used to pile on that sofa playing games and eating snacks and takeout? remember everyone yelling at Tyler, not wiping his hands, and getting grease all over the controllers. I remember getting my ass handed to me by Grill. Aha! Uh -huh. So Grill is the Lord Protector. Grill and Super Hypodermic Canteen Fighters 3. Sat behind the couch and drank, so I'm technically undefeated in SHCF3. Hey, so you, you all do remember. It means something to all of us. And that's why it's coming with... 
So that's cute. They actually all used to be friends before whatever the hell happened. Man, this got very white palace very fast. Was that insight mushroom? The expression supposed to convey death. I am extremely dangerous. Enemies still hurt. But I hurt a lot. Hope you guys like bleeding. Not entirely sure how you get a clam to bleed necessarily. Well, no, I guess I kind of understand how it's supposed to work, but it's weird. Okay, so we've got another thing here. There's an old photo on top of this stack. So that's... That's Grill there. That must be Emma in the back. Old photos. Where did my extra heart go? It was uh, based on a food product that I had eaten. And I cycled that out in favor of uh, getting a temporary heart every 10 seconds instead. I figured that was the safer choice. And I'm standing by that statement because... This way I effectively have a 20 HP... A temporary 20 HP regen. every short while and considering I'm not really fighting things that much I can just kind of uh, kick back and let it go I'm taking a lot of damage it means I should probably kick back and wait for a bit I wonder if the main character is a friend of theirs also I am unsure he seems like he showed up last and they haven't mentioned him yet I, I do really appreciate the, the fact that this is, like, a fairly substantive story. Are you going to do that thing with the flame every time we recover a recipe? Stop messing around. You're not being rational. Spirit who can't eat teaching a zombie to cook. The apprentice is just eating the foods for its effects. Zombies can't, they can't taste anything, can't carry on anything. Yeah. But it's not like you've done anything either. Tell me what you got. Those notes have already lost their value. There's no one left to use them. No one left to eat magical foods. You know this. If you're serious about it, you wouldn't spend all your time planting plants and raising magical creatures. <sighs> Said these creatures are everything. The age of humans is over. We don't need to die for our survival anymore. We should be doing our best to protect them. The age of humans isn't over. I'll open the Stargate and prove it to you. Stargate? I thought you gave up on that. I've explained this to you a thousand times, but you still won't face the consequences. You're wasting your time. I'll burn your peons. If before... Uh, if? Well, be, burn your peons if, if before they get to that gate. Cooking is an art. Those of us that do it bust our brains trying to create dishes that make people happy. Hard work, but at the same time, it's fun and rewarding. I feel such a sense of accomplishment when I see my friends and the stuff I make. That's why I spend so much time in the field and in the kitchen researching and improving my cooking. Right. Right now. None of that is possible if we stay here. To be honest, as good as it looks, I don't know what the food you make tastes like. I don't think you have working taste buds either. More importantly, nobody here wants to eat our food. What's the point of being a chef if there's no one to feed? Right now, we're just using cooking as a stepping stone to strengthen you and reach the Stargate. But for a brighter future and a return to our old lives, this is something we must do. Halcyon Heights Recipes. Reveal the culinary secrets of Halcyon Heights. Yeah, the music... For that specific song is incredibly loud. Otherwise, the game is very quiet, but that 
that specific bit of music is just like boom bomb 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 and it's like uh, not much i can do about it damn it not this again Like, to some small degree, what am I supposed to do? Developers need to fix their stuff. Hello. Permanent dash. Oh. Never really found dash, did I? Uh, Soul juice of the forest to your battle stations. Do not allow Simmer's dogs to run wild in the city. Activate your traps. All hands on deck. Banish the unclean to the depths. This isn't the first time you asked us to sacrifice our lives. You forget your priorities. Simmer only treats you like ingredients. Our great lord is the only one keeping this place together. To die for her is the highest honor. And lord wants to release the herbivores on us. We're worse off if it... Silence! Kill that zombie or I shall report you to the lord protector and you'll be punished. Fine, fine, whatever. Is that like a pea shooter? It is a pea shooter. Or a bean. Well, I am pretty freaking ridiculous with all of these. Okay, so those do do... Those do do damage. That does damage, but it doesn't actually do too much. Avoided it. That's okay. I'll just wait for the temp hearts to come back. Watching an enemy die like that is actually pretty great. Oh! Oh, no, those traps don't turn off. Oh. Okay, whatever. What do we have here? Uh, let's see. Bow attack damage by 50% if no damage is taken. And max health by 20 increases. Axe and hatchet damage by 5. Not useful. <sighs> ah. And I also have a bean gun, if I wanted to go for, like, a Rudy Tootie gun and shooty build. But I don't really. My tongue there. Ah, it's all spiders! Okay. Fried durian puffs. High calorie, high in fat, and good for high blood pressure. What? Really? I would say it would be good for giving you... I had blood pressure more than anything else. No zombie Rambo then? I had considered it. What the hell is this guy? Oh, it's corn, I think. Rice. Okay. Hard to find a good bowl of rice in this day and age. We enjoying all of that damage over time. Knife pieces. Pieces will decay and soften if not used properly. Oh. Perfect dodges actually uh Perfect dodges give you idea points which heal you. That's kind of nuts. I'm just gonna hang out here while these guys slowly just pass away. Oh, it's a thing of beauty. What the hell's going on here? Oh. It's like dried meat and stuff. Uh, I'm supposed to find a way to stop you. But I don't feel like it. You go on ahead. Can't really stick my neck out for a leader who doesn't care about the lives of plants. 
Wood Protector doesn't care about plant people. She just wants to bring about sustainability and a balanced ecosystem and other strange things. Things that don't even matter to us. For that system, we'd just be eaten by herbivores. Why do we have to sacrifice ourselves for the ecosystem? We have to follow a leader that just wants us dead. I should let you defeat her. At least I know you and the necromancer are just looking for things. Compared to her, the damage you do is almost negligible. That's wrong and false and what the hell. Are you the fearsome, despicable, undead soldier of Simmer? Good! Please partake in my blood and flesh and allow me to assist you. Lord Protector's tyranny is ruining our livelihoods. We're the victims of a dictatorship and plants are just falling orders. Every day the Lord Protector rules. Is a day our rights are oppressed? Eat me! Let me sacrifice myself for the future. For the destruction of the tyranny. Watermelon. These grow on trees, right? Mm. Not sure about that. How are these guys again? This game is modifiable. Stacking food would be cool. Oh, like having multiple effects? Would certainly be interesting. I... I'd certainly love it if it was moddable. Like, I will admit, I'm pretty sure this is a Korean game? Either Korean or Chinese. And those tend to be less modifiable comparatively. Which is unfortunate, but I could see somebody if they really had the uh the time, effort, and interest could absolutely modify. I mean almost any game is modifiable if you try hard enough. There is there's a trap here, is there not? No? But yeah, more food slots would be interesting. Definitely being able to st stack buffs would be cool. That. Yo, that gives me some free idea points. Doesn't help too much. That's okay. Hello. That's fast travel. What do we have left? Okay, so we're... We're, oh, we're a little bit past the halfway point on this game. I know it's early access, so there's still a lot more left. Ooh, poison or bleeding effects of daggers by 20%. Honestly, I think I'm going to get rid of the crab shell bisque. Horizontal slash, nah. More bleed, you say? I think I think I'm currently it's poison currently, but yes, more bleed. Say, rice cutter. No, it's a sword. I was hoping for a secondary uh, dagger as well, but all of my daggers are primary. I'll keep chucking the poison vial.